Sydney and much of the East Coast has experienced very humid and hot conditions over recent days and the oppressive humidity is set to linger this week. Our meteorologist Alison Osborne has more. A humid, unstable air mass has been responsible behind the very uncomfortable and stormy weather through eastern Australia so far this week. During Monday, Sydney's relative humidity remained firmly above 20 degrees, something more commonly seen over tropical parts of the country. Now, the dew point is the temperature to which the air must be cooled in order to become completely saturated. Completely saturated air, well, that's if you're sitting in fairly thick Fog. Now you can see 20 to 24 degrees for a dew point puts it in the uncomfortable sphere for those who live in temperate mid-latitude zones and that includes Brisbane as well as Sydney. More comfortable conditions are on the way. The dew points will drop to 10 or 15 degrees but not until Friday. Now taking a look at the forecast dew point over eastern Australia we can see a humid air mass will still be lingering over the nation's east. It will be uncomfortable once more particularly for coastal parts and this includes Brisbane, Sydney and possibly Canberra. Anywhere in that light orange shading, those are those uncomfortable dew points. Now, this will remain the case in to the middle of the coming week. This is despite a cool change advancing through southeastern Australia. It's just not reaching the New South Wales coast. Moving into Thursday, though, a stronger frontal system and a significant cold outbreak will be on the way for the southeast. This should move through the New South Wales coast in the early hours of Friday morning. Dry wet Westerly winds off the land will then drop the dew point, finally bringing some comfort to Sydney siders. It will remain muggy and uncomfortable with chances of storms for you in Brisbane.